We are standing in the magnificent lobby of the new Ellen Price Science Commons and Research Library. We are looking at a place where people, services, programs, faculty, students, all converge to advance science at the University of Oregon. Alan Price is one of those individuals who thought outside the box. And this idea is something that's outside the box. It's fitting that it's named after him. It will help our research mission immensely. This is the D'Armond Makerspace. The Makerspace is open to all University of Oregon community members. And so, you know, there may be staff and faculty who may want to use it, but really I suspect students from product design, from architecture, from the sciences, would be very, very heavy users of this space. Um, it gives them access to tools that they don't have access to otherwise. Here on the lower level, we have a large group classroom, we have a smaller group classroom, we have individual study spaces that can be very quiet. We also have places for students to work in groups. It's really important for them to be able to do that because science and studying science can be a little bit messy. We have rooms for hard sciences, human physiology, chemistry, physics. We also have um, folks in them who can help with learning the materials. This is the visualization lab and, and it's a new screen, uh, 50 million pixels, which is the largest visualization labs here in the state of Oregon. Research nowadays is, is collecting and producing more and more data, larger and larger data sets. This system is going to enable a lot of people to be able to dig in a little bit deeper into what their research is producing. I use this a lot. I'm here just to take a break in between classes. I'm studying here using the computers to do presentations. Um, I do have tutors here that help me out. Um, with my chemistry classes. I love that it unites people studying different things like geology, chemistry, um, physics, and unites us um, all together kind of studying one overarching topic which is the sciences. Thank you for your generosity in making this amazing space possible for all the students to enjoy. I love the name. It's a science commons and it is common to all the students here. It's a place for students to interact, to gain knowledge, but really to work on problems together, to problem solve, cooperate, innovate, it's going to be an exciting venue for that. This building would not have been possible without the generosity of Lori Loke. It's a wonderful vision and he helped us get Alan Price Science Commons off the ground.